Guys, the chicken is here, back today with another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we're fighting, we're scrapping, we're crawling. Uh, we got back into 20, and we're just waiting on a couple more things before we push up. And we're going to go over our next uh, tech tree changes in this video. And also, guys, make sure you're using the code chicken in the shop if you want to be entered into the giveaway. Simple as you use the code before you buy something. And uh, let me know in the comments. Better yet, send me a screenshot or become a channel member. Um, you'll all be included in the giveaway. So, with that being said, let's take a look at the tech tree, guys. Let's take a look. So, you'll see I got uh, 37 keys, 3 million tokens. Uh, my plan here being, I think I'm just going to hang on tight and I'm going to go uh, for rocket launchers. I'm going to max them out. Then, what I'm going to do is max out building damage. Now, we have a couple different paths we can go here. There's a couple different things people have done. Some people have gone right away and... Um, Went straight for shock launchers from five year. Now I think this is you know shock launchers are good. I'll uh, you you have to get them at some point, um, but I don't think they're going to make as much of a difference as rocket launchers because um, one there's only two of them versus five rockets, um, but they typically just hit the heavies. Like if the heavies hit a shock miner if they're getting hit by a shock launcher, it's not the end of the world. I mean, you get stuck at the end and you, like, mess up your attack and there's one hitting bombers. Obviously, that's a big difference. But for the most part, you can kind of just rush them and they don't really make that much of a difference. Um, the next thing... God, this is driving me insane. Um, I don't know what's going on with my recording stuff, guys. It's been a mess lately. Um, so, the, uh, the next choice that we have is is uh, we could go the artillery route. Now, barrage and artillery, haven't really seen a BART meta develop at all, so I wouldn't hang your hat on that uh, on that path either. We do have some nice protos um, up up here at, after five years. Um, the Doom Cannon one seems to be the choice, and probably the Grappler would be the other choice. Maybe the Laser Beam. Kind of, I've seen a couple lasers. Again, they're not that prevalent. Um, they're not that good. They're not, they're not really crushing guys left and right. Um, the Melon Bombers have enough health where they can, you know, take several laser shots. So, yeah, I'd probably go Doom Cannon and Grappler, I think, uh, would probably make the most sense. Um, but, yeah, like I said, I'm going to focus on building damage. I'm going to focus on the rocket launchers and just try to really beef up that defense. That's that's really what I'm kind of leaning towards this season is uh, hanging back a little bit more and just building up that defense. So, by the time, you know, by the time we get, um, by the time we get ahead a little bit, um and you know by the time we get to six ERs, we won't have to go back that much uh, it's also a longer season so i think it's okay if it's a little bit stagnant um for a few days it's not really the end of the world um because we're just kind of building towards the end of the season so and we're hanging out in 20 so i mean we're not doing that badly but um but yeah so let's talk about offense now um the biggest change i've made and i just started doing this is I went two heavies and six bombardiers. And basically the reason for that is at 5 ER, um, we're a little bit more spread out, right? It's not as um, important to have that front line of heavies. You need them at the start for sure. But they're more for just simply mine clearing. Like they don't do a whole pile else. They're mine clearers and they take some boom uh, boom cannon shots. Um, but other than that, like say that was a waste. They're heavy, that was stupid. Uh, but that's okay. Uh, bricks gonna get shocked. Heavies are gonna get shocked as well. Um, there we go. Now, what I like to do to prevent them from spreading too badly into ways that we don't want, um, I like to flare one of the defenses kind of in the middle. Um, I find once you do that and then you free clear, you can really, one, you can take down all these defenses in the center pretty quickly. And you also get a fairly decent spread of where you want your bombers. Um, so we can just go right here just like this, and then we're just going to go bang, 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 and, and take down all those engine rooms just like that. So there we go. Now, I lost a couple of them on the bottom there, but I think overall that was pretty solid. So let's see where Mr. Marco Polo is, and it looks like we are going to come away with this one. He was using, he was using uh, heavies and uh, <coughs> heavy chopper, rocket chopper, which, you know, I, I've seen it. It's not... It's not been crazy. I mean, if you're really good with the rocket choppers, obviously that's a good choice. But, whoo, man, one second. 
I thought we got 255 there, not 253. Um, whatever. So let's see what Marco did here. Um, now, when you're using heavy choppers and rocket choppers, it's you're essentially flaring to engine rooms. Um, you know, flaring to engine rooms and then using barrage or critters or whatever on the far, farthest one away. I mean, it can work, but we were able to get lucky there by uh, winning by a second. So let's uh, let's get into another one here, guys. But yeah, let me know down below in the comments how you're doing, uh, how you're making out uh, so far. You know, overall, I'd say I'm enjoying this season, but I, I, it, it felt kind of like... Think of it this way. I haven't unlocked uh, anything um, aside from the engine room. And that took like three or four days. So it was like three or four days of like nothing of just like just playing with what we had, um, which gets kind of stale. I mean, it is warships, right? So it's always going to be kind of stale at some point. But uh, I don't know. Other than that, I've been having a, a pretty good time this season. I think it's been fairly enjoyable. Um, oh, this guy's got four engines. I didn't even notice. Um, okay, let's use critters over here just in case we get some stray bombers. But this we sh should be should be pretty good to just kind of free clear battle orders and make our way right along through it. Let's see what happens here. And we'll let that one go down on the bottom. It's nice to free clear, obviously, with the melon bombers because, you know, you, you get that splash damage and it really does... Um, you know, if you can take out, like, five or six buildings really quickly, then that's usually the way to go. Um, yeah, you see right there, like, we just ripped through that flamethrower, no problems. Let's shock this machine gun. I'll hit some of the heavies, but who cares? And for the four AR bases, I mean, as long as we're getting, like, three plus, he's not going to finish us three plus at uh, four AR. I hope not, anyways. That would be pretty bad. All right, there we go. So, yeah, that one was kind of easy. But uh, we'll take it. We'll take it. Now, obviously, the next goal is to get into Diamond as quickly as possible so we can start getting more keys. Um, but I don't know if that's going to... Um, I don't know how easy that's going to be. I was going to unplug this. Um, yeah, I think the biggest thing holding us back is, uh, is just a lack of... Um, it's like we need that one more thing. It's like we got to 5 ER and it's like good and we're like right on the edge of, of pushing through, but... Uh, we need, uh, rock launchers, shock launchers, heavy choppers, something like that. Um, I would, I wouldn't go with bullet. Uh, I wouldn't go with bullet at all this season. I don't think he's needed. Um, <clears throat> I, I, I really think brick is going to be the hero for the entire season. So, um, you know, bullets, very expensive. He's a lot of keys. So I, I, I don't think he's, uh, I don't think he's the guy this season. Battle ongoing. Is this battle going to end or what is going on? We just saw him. He was like a few seconds away before we disconnected. Well, didn't disconnect, but chicken disconnected with this stupid thing. Ah, we need a new computer, guys. We need a computer. This is all on the laptop, but uh, yeah, computer is probably, probably better for those kinds of issues. Anyways, chicken's technical absurdities beside. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um... All right, so we're going up against a another 5ER. So more of an even match this time. Uh, now let's take out... I like to take a... I try not to use more than two um, things of critters until we get closer to the end. Um, uh, I should have shocked that boom cannon. Yeah, I try not to use more than two buckets of critters if we don't have to. Um... Because it just slows us up from using battlers. We want to use as many battlers as we can. That's what really makes the difference. Okay, we got one bomber going down. Thank God. Uh, and then we can just free clear from here. I think we are going to lose this one because I let uh, some of those bombers die on the end. Um, then maybe we'll go back and take a look at our defense and see if there's any little tweaks we can make. Because um, it does look like this guy is going to beat us, but we'll see. Okay, there we go. And we lost our battle orders train. That's going to hurt. Okay, come on, heavies, hit those mines for us. Just gonna let them free clear. And that's gonna be that. So, I mean, we could have got two or three battlers left there if I uh, if Brick had survived. So, a little bit unfortunate, a little bit unfortunate, but overall, that's what we've been doing. Uh, we'll stay here. Maybe we'll get lucky. Ah! It beat us by quite a bit. But let's take a look at our defense and see what we can do. Um, 
Now, there's a couple things I did on this base. Um, I want them to hit me like this, where they drop from all different spots. I find that it's it's very hard. Like, they can get a better, like, a decent time doing this, but it's very hard to get a really good time. So as long as I'm, like, in the 250 range, um, then we can usually hold on. Like, it requires them to think. They can't just drop from the right in the space because it kind of pulls them off to the other side. Um, and they have to spend a ton of GBE because I don't really have any mines or anything protecting them going this way. Um, but yeah. For the most part, I'm pretty happy with this base. And I don't think that's what's holding us back. I think what's holding us back is not having that one next defense that uh, that we need to work towards. And that is going to be... I think we'll get it. We'll get it on the chest after the next one. So it'll come in like the middle of the night, of course. But uh, that is the plan, guys. That's the strategy. Let me know what your strategy is down below in the comments section below. Uh, make sure to subscribe for everything. Warship Season 15, Boom Beach. You know what to do because you're already doing it. Keep it tuned right here. I'm the... Ch Wait a second. That's somebody else's thing. See you next one, guys. Check it out. Back, back, back.